Hello, in this video I want to share with you how to navigate your Blackboard course with the progress tracking. If your instructor has progress tracking turned on, you'll see on the left side of the course interface, you'll see progress tracking on. Um, I'm going to show you how that works so you can help keep track of everything that you're doing in your course. So this is one of my courses uh, that is online. Uh, this works for hybrid courses as well. It just depends on if your instructor has progress tracking turned on. So if you look at the different modules here. They're locked. It's currently not available. But this one here that has an empty circle will, uh, oh wow, that's fun. This item will be March complete once all the children have been completed. Oh boy, that's a fun little nugget. Anyway, so, <laughs> uh, anyway, wow, that was crazy. So anyway, the, when the circle is empty, that means that the task is empty also, which means it hasn't been started. So I'm going to click on this module so it will open. And you can see all the little circles, empty circles, and it says this item cannot be marked, started, until it is opened. So we have all of these different things that are we have not opened, so they are not marked. So I'm going to click on Course Overview. And this is just some information. There's some videos in here. This is what I show to my students. And I'm going to exit out of this just so you can see that now both this circle and this circle have something in them, which means that it has been started, that you have viewed this page, this document. And this works for links as well. So this says this item cannot be marked started until it is opened. Once I click on this link, it's going to open in a new tab. And it's going to think and think and think and think and think. <laughs> but now that I've opened the link, it's going to show that it has been started. So there's, ah, it's still taking a while. There we go. There they, there's the supportive services. Okay. So Going back to our Blackboard interface, because I have clicked on this link, it shows that I have started. I have the capacity, if your instructor has progress tracking turned on, I now have the capacity to mark that item as complete. So I click on it and a little blue check mark comes up. Yay, it is complete. I cannot change this to completed status until it's halfway filled. So I'm going to click on course instructor here and there's information about me, all that kind of stuff. So I can navigate through just like this, just like you normally do in Blackboard. I can navigate through like this and now it's going to show that all of those items have been opened. But since I know that I have read them, I can mark them as complete. So this is great if you've got an assignment that you want to go back to. Um, like if you've got assignment instructions and you're like, oh, I really like, I definitely know that I need to go back and look at this later. You can see that you've looked at it, but you don't have to check it off that it's not complete. But once you do complete the assignment and upload, for example, I will, um, I'll go into my syllabus quiz here. And because it hasn't, been, oh, now it's been started. So there's the, there's the indicator that it's been started. So I'm going to hop in and do my syllabus quiz. And I already know the answers to all of these things. So I'll just uh, click them very quickly. True, true. There we go. Submit. I will submit my quiz. I will get the confirmation that yes, my submission was successful. I don't need to download it, so I will close it. And now, if I go back and look at it again, boop, 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 it's thinking, <laughs> loading more content items. It's thinking about it. But once uh, once it does come up, it will show that the assignment has been pushed through. Even if you have unlimited uh, or a certain number of attempts that you can make, like I, my syllabus quiz is set up to be unlimited attempts until you get all 10 points, um, it will still show up as checked. So 
status will automatically change when a new attempt or post is started. So if you do decide to do a second attempt, it will go back to being a half-filled circle. So this is a great way to keep track of your progress. Um, that way you know what you have left to do as far as your assignments and your lectures or videos or anything like that as far as those go. I'm just kind of quickly rolling through these so that I can get all of my check marks or all of my this has been started so I can check them all, mark them all as complete. And then once all of these are marked complete, once all of these are marked complete, <laughs> I'm a little draggy today, I don't know why, but there we go. But then it will show that the entire module is complete. So when the module is closed, you see you've completed everything in that module. So yay for you. I hope you have a fantastic semester and you're going to do great. Keep track of your progress and I wish you the best of luck. Success. You've got this.